Good day, people. Jeffrey Howells Carpet Cleaning out here in Gresham, Oregon today, and we are cleaning up a car, uh, old work car. So let's go ahead and take a look at what we're going to be doing. First, I'll start off with our chemistry. I'm using this soap-free uh, uh, fabric cleaner, upholstery cleaner by Master Blend. It works very good. It is in a granule form, so it pretty much has an uh, infinite shelf life, probably 25 years or so. Um, like dehydrated food but anyways you just add it to hot water and mix it in and it works perfect um, what I generally will do is I will uh, it's two scoops per gallon of water so in like 12 or 16 ounce measuring cup um, I'll fill it with water and mix in the the solution and then I'll nuke it in the microwave for about a minute and that just helps heat it up and dissolve it and everything and then I'll I'll add it into our jug of water um, tools for today, I'm going to be using this crevice tool and the upholstery tool attachments and the brush for agitation. And as you can see, it's extremely uh, soiled in here because of the years of use that this car has gotten um, as a work vehicle. But anyways, um, good for us is that anything that we do here is going to make this vehicle appear 90% better than what it is right now. So we're just going to do our best job, get this thing cleaned up and looking awesome. We'll probably go through with a, uh, a quick uh, vacuum, dry vacuum. I'm using the truck. I've got this uh, pre-filter so everything is just going to end up in there anyways and stay out of the filter and the, the van anyhow. And we'll just take that and dump it and will be good to get going again there shortly after so uh, there you have it we'll put down our pre-spray after our vacuum we'll let it dwell in there and break down and emulsify all that gunk and then we'll go back with our attachment tools and extract everything out very well so I hope you enjoy the results and we'll show you what we end up with Right, Jeffrey Howells Carpet Cleaning. We're out in Gresham, Oregon, finishing up our job here at the car. As you can see, there is um, so much mud under there that it's probably under the carpet, so it's literally impossible to get it all clean unless you pulled all that upholstery out and like sprayed out the car. But um, it's at least 90% cleaner right now. So there you have it. 